Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to another fresh episode of Ramadan TV. Today we have been invited to have Iftar at Burj College in Elizabeth campus. We're going to find out a little bit more about what this college has to offer for the community as well as if we can have some time to spend with their families to tell us a little bit more about what they think and how this school is going. So find out, to find out a little bit more, come with me to spend some time with them. I have with me right now Brother Nuruddin. He is one of the teachers at Burj uh, College. He is uh, with us uh, and we're going to ask him a few questions, inshallah. Brother Nuruddin, how are you? Alhamdulillah, and you? Yeah, Alhamdulillah. Brother Nuruddin, tell us wh where are we? Where is this place? Uh, we are now in the uh, prayer room for the Islamic uh, student, Muslim students in the school, and uh, this is Elizabeth Campus. And uh, this is where we pray our Juma Salat and our also Zuhr and Asr for the students who are here after school. So there are facilities. This, this facility, particularly here, is for it's what we call a praying room. Yeah, yes, that's prayer room. So it's more or less a masjid. We have the everything that a masjid has in terms of a uh, wudu area back there, and also sometimes in school holidays, some kids uh, utilize the place as a camping place. So we have some camp beds in the other room where they uh, come for camping. And what do you teach here? I teach religion and Arabic, and I'm the head of my department and also a secondary coordinator. Very good. So is this, we can say this room here facilitates for people on Jum'ah particularly. Um, for Jum'ah prayer, it gets held in here. Do you run our Jum'ah prayer here? Yeah, we mean outsiders do come and pray with us here. So it's just not, it's not only for students, outsiders who live around come and pray with us here. We used to pray with the ladies and the ladies used the room where I just mentioned earlier. But now we have a specific place in the main building that the girls used to pray. But this place is mainly a prayer room and we pray Juma and Zuhr and Asr as I made mention earlier. Excellent. Yes. What do you think of the students? Are they, uh, you can uh, say they are high level, medium or low here? Well, it depends on uh, what you're looking at because the main aim of a school is academic achievement and also having said that we try to uh, train our students to be uh, responsible citizens in the community to be able to represent Islam and also to represent the wider range of Australian community. So having said that, academic wise, our students are up to the level regarding the school from 2005 coming is less than 10 years now. But uh, if we compare our students with any other school that has been there for so many years, we can see achievement level, we are competing, we are doing our best. And also kids are kids. So anywhere they are behavior wise, you do your best. But uh, you know, we are in a system where you just have to understand kids. They have to behave as kids anywhere they are. Excellent. Do you think um, religion studies, Islamic studies makes a difference to the kids behavior at the school? Yeah, generally, I think that's our main uh, advantage because if you look at the background of the school with the context, it's just more or less multicultural school, not Islamic school as uh, many may say. But having said that, through our, our religious classes and pastoral care, we're able to help our students and get them to understand how to behave themselves so that behavior in classrooms are more better regarding other kids where they don't get the opportunity to study Islam. So I think through the religious teachings, we get our kids to behave well. 
I can say I'm a sincere one. And Alhamdulillah, we all know that every good thing, every beautiful thing starts with faith, integrity, love and sincerity. And I think what we have got here is that, is sincerity. And it's not just me, it's not just my friends, if you just look around, this is what you can see on the faces of uh, people who work with me on the street. I have with me right now, Brother Murad, uh, the principal of Bush College. Brother Murad, thank you for having us. Yeah, thank you uh, for being with us today. Jazakallah khair. Brother Murad, um, we, we've we come to Bush College and we're seeing a tremendous, uh, uh, magnificent building here and we're seeing uh, the development has increased tremendously from the last time we've seen this place and the number of students has increased. Tell us a little bit more about Bush College itself and what it's offering to the public. Yeah, Bush College... Uh as probably most of you know, it started in 2005, uh, Gillis Plains, uh, as a small campus, uh, as a small school, uh, with many hardships and difficulties. Uh, Alhamdulillah, uh, with the growth, uh, the board needed to buy another land here in Elizabeth. And then uh, in 2010, uh, we started uh, secondary school here. Then, uh, you know, uh, that one as well grow, uh, you know, growing, 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 and we, uh, uh, Alhamdulillah, uh, we had to turn this into a full uh, school from uh, foundation to year 12. So at the moment, uh, uh, we have got more than 400 students at uh, both campuses. Uh, our Gillis Plain campus is uh, reception foundation to year 6, and uh, Elizabeth campus is uh, from uh, reception to uh, year 12. Exciting, very good. Tell us some of the services that you provide here to the to the um, to the community. Is it just for the Muslim community, or is it actually open to everybody else as well? Well, I think uh, the, our message, you know, uh, as Muslim, is not just for uh, Muslims. Uh, it's open to everyone. So we're very confident that uh, uh, opening our doors to uh, different communities, and uh, Alhamdulillah, we got some uh, people from outside. And uh, what die with our colors, you know, uh, they uh, they're happy with our environment. They're happy with our cultural values, and uh, and they are briefly happy about. But our major, uh, uh, you know, uh, parent profile is uh, still uh, Muslim uh, peoples from uh, uh, Muslim coming from different backgrounds, many different backgrounds. Um, being in Elizabeth. Um, I'm sure a lot of people are thinking, okay, in Elizabeth, it's 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 a bit out there, yeah, well, we're very far, uh, very far <laughs> away. Is there services for people around um, the other side or the around the city area or something to come and join you guys at yeah. this campus here? Yes, yes, yes. That's probably one of the uh, distinctive uh, side of our school. Uh, we're not um, uh, catering the needs of the people around the uh, campuses. Uh, we've got bus services all around Adelaide. So it's it's not a big problem. It's not a big problem uh, who, who would like to enroll uh, uh, their children at our school. I'm sure uh, we can easily help them with our bus services. Future plan. Future plan. Well, there are a lot of uh, future plans. Uh, we've got a very dynamic structure, uh, as you just uh, you know stated at the start of your uh, interview. Uh, we're changing. We're changing very fast. For the future, Alhamdulillah, uh, for the first time, we are um, uh, we are going to give you out our graduates to the community, and uh, our main focus uh, at this stage is um, our. Uh, university entrance, uh, you know, uh, uh, success, and uh, we are uh, from the other end. Uh, we are planning to open here a press school. Uh, there is a big demand, so uh, and uh, we have got uh, ongoing um, um, constructions in this campus. Uh, now we are, as you can see, we are uh, in a brand new uh, facility. Uh, we're extending that. It's our primary uh, and uh, administration side of the school, uh, primary school. We're extending that. 
and uh, for glass planes also it's uh, becoming very small for us and we're looking for a land so, uh, that we can move into and uh, uh, you know uh, offer a better uh, facility or uh, parents and uh, our students very good lots of exciting news um, it's exciting already because we're seeing this place it's become so big um, so fast alhamdulillah and it's to a level where it's a, it's a I can say it's a world class level now, Alhamdulillah, which is really good. With, with the community support, I should just admit that, uh, you know, we have got a very hard work, uh, working, sincere staff members here, especially uh, our brothers and sisters. Uh, you could see some uh, people from the community working here Saturday, Sunday, and you could see our... Uh, 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 students in front of the mosque, uh, you know, uh, handing out our, our flyers. So that, that's a sign of a good love, and I, I'm very proud of that. I am very happy, uh, you know, uh, working at this uh, school, uh, and hopefully we will maintain that, and we will make it better and better with the community support. And we're happy as well to have a team like your team working together hand in hand to grow and expand this uh, society to a better better future inshallah. inshallah we thank you so much for having us uh, with you at your campus and we surely have enjoyed our day here we've uh, we've spent a good time here and we are going to spend some more time really meeting the fam the families and the parents and uh, see a bit more of the school so come with me to find out a bit more about the this amazing college birch college and we want to thank you thank for you. having My us away. My pleasure. Jazakallah khair and we'll see you around. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs>
How is Ramadan in Adelaide compared to Melbourne and Russia? Um, to be honest, uh, in Melbourne we have like a huge Turkish community here, there. Uh, but however, we have a lot of uh, Muslims here. I didn't know that we don't. We have a lot of Muslim here. Alhamdulillah. Are they making? Are, are they? Are they making you feel home? Yes, definitely. We speak in uh, Russian, in Uzbek, Turkish. Mashallah, Mashallah. Lots of languages. I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. Jazakumullah khair for being with us. Enjoy the rest of the night. Assalamu alaikum alaykum wa Thank you very much giving us this chance. No worries. Assalamu alaykum. Wa alaykum assalam. Wa alaykum assalam.